Welcome to the Mark West Sports Podcast. You already I, got it. It's a must. I already if, got it. If you don't have the sweet potato pie. I'm not coming. Don't call me. I'm not coming through unless you got it on deck. Because mm-hmm. it has to be there, you know, as far as desserts are concerned. But everything. The Patty else, LaBelle you know, one. To go. Patty the Patty LaBelle. LaBelle one. The Patty we LaBelle one. We got that shit in the refrigerator right now, brother. <laughs> <laughs> we got that shit in the refrigerator right now. So it, it's, it's ready. But, uh, that's probably going to be the best part of Thanksgiving tomorrow, which is the food, because the games are kind of garbage. You know, yeah. like the two games that we got going on, the Texans and the um, and the Lions. I'm about tired of seeing the damn Lions on, on Thanksgiving. Like, I understand it's tradition. I remember I looked it up a, a while ago. Like, why is the D- Detroit and Dallas always on Thanksgiving? It's like but a it's, guarantee win. Yeah, it's, a, it's been a tradition since like the 60s or whatever. Um, so it's just been tradition, but we got to see the sorry ass lions every year. And this year, I feel like they're going to get mopped by, by the Texans, to be honest. Um, maybe not mop mop, but because uh, Matthew Stafford always finds a way to kind of keep his team in games, but he's been injured last week and, and I think they were shut out last week. Mm-hmm. And so if he is not hundred percent, yeah, I think the Texans mop him. If he's regular Matthew Stafford, I think it'll be a close game because the boy Deshaun Watson is just doing a lot with a little bit, you know, he's just doing a lot with a little bit. And I think he's going to do enough uh, to win that game uh, tomorrow. You know, I ain't trying to hear that. I'm thinking about our draft pick. Right. <laughs> so Stafford, your ass need to play. Right. You need to play and you need to be your normal self. Please. You're fully healed from your back injury and all that. You know, wife is good. You know, family's good. Yo, you need to do your thing. You need to do your thing. I, I don't really want to talk too much about this game. I just want to say you need to win. I don't care if you win by field goal, you win by one point, you win by safety. Win this game. Because last week, the Texans already got a win. And it kind of upset me because I'm like, fuck, we're just falling down in the draft because the Dolphins are the doing Patriots good. Too. Huh? They beat the Patriots, too. Yeah, like what the, like, <laughs> come on. Come on, Cam. (laughs) Come on, Cam. Yeah, just just trash. That is what it is, man. (laughs) So, yeah, you got the the Texans. The spread on that game is three, just so you know. The spread on that that game is three. And the Benjamin Report is saying Texans are going to cover that three. But the Dolphins fan in the Benjamin Report is hoping that Detroit destroys the Texans. (laughs) Thank you. Thank you. Then so you got the got, next game. We got Dallas versus Washington. Both teams is garbage right now. Garbage but game. I think, you know, Dallas look like they're showing a little light. They're showing like a little glimmer of hope. Like they're yeah. finding themselves a little bit without um Dak. Yeah. So, um, you know, I think Dallas Cowboys going to win. You know, it's not too much to say about Dallas because they haven't showed us much. They've been losing for the longest. Yeah, they won last week. But, you know, you got to show me something more than once for me to actually believe in you. Um, so, you know, I know that Washington, Washington football team, and I kind of like that name, Washington football team, you know, they don't <laughs> need no mascot. Fuck it. You know, we just, FC. exactly, you know, but, but, but I think Washington, um, they're, they're still, you know, dysfunctional organization, just like Dallas, but, but, you know, um, I think Dallas is going to go ahead and find a way and keep that tradition going and take out oh, another win, you know, on a big platform, there's no other games. You know, you want to show the league like, yo, like, let's pull up two wins in a row, you know. But I mean, the 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 our division is not that great anyway. So we could probably if we if we if we find ourselves, we could win a few and be right in the mix in the end of the season. You know, I think we have like six games left, you know. Let's see what we can do, you know, and and so so I think Dallas gonna win this one. I don't know the spread. I'll just say, um, since both of them garbage, I was say 21 to like 10 you know 21 to 10 all right so the spread is dallas by three and i i agree with you 100 percent. i feel like dallas is going to win this game um the fact that they got andy dalton back i mean andy dalton is garbage but he's like you know a step above garbage you know <laughs> <laughs> you know he's the recycling bin <laughs> yeah yeah he's the recycling bin quarterback you know with, with, you know, with red hair or whatever you know mm-hmm. this guy 
I think is just going to be enough for them to win. And, and I want to point out, it's kind of the classic Cowboys and Indians matchup too on Thanksgiving. Mm -hmm. I feel like they mm -hmm. set that up on purpose, you know? Uh, the Washington Redskins used to be the Redskins, uh -huh. but everybody know they're the Redskins, you know, just, you know, we just calling them the football team right now. So it's uh -huh. the Cowboys basically versus the Indians on on national TV, it's like, man, that seems like too much of a setup about how they set that up. But well, of course, yeah, but hey. yeah, but um, I'm gonna go with the Cowboys on this, even though I, in real life, I would go with the Indians, <laughs> you know, yeah. just because you know they were here and you know, yeah, you know how they be. I don't want to go through the shit. history of all of that, but yeah, you know, it's it's kind of messed up about how even Thanksgiving even started. Yeah, you know, basically, it was a massacre of the Indians. Mm -hmm. yeah, I think it's going to be a massacre on the football field <laughs> with the Dallas Cowboys um, against the Washington <laughs> Redskins, you know, because I feel like this is a team that's on fire. Um, and Alex Smith, al although he's a good story, you know, come back from that leg injury from last year, the quarterback for the football team. Um, I don't think he has enough. I think that Dallas defense finally is like coming into their own. And I think they win this game in that sorry ass division of the NFC East. So that's all the games on, on Thanksgiving. There are no good college games, by the way, on Thanksgiving. The, the and better are, game's gonna be the next day. Yeah, <laughs> what you mean? Exactly. Exactly. So we might as well just transition into that since that Ravens Steelers game, as we mentioned, is moved to Sunday. And we got a really interesting game, not only that will affect the outcome of the ACC championship game or and